breaking news. Nigerian Supreme Court stops Buhari government from spending old Naira notes by February 10. Cancel for the applicants urge the Supreme Court to grant the application in the interest of justice and the well-being of Nigeria. Hi guys, welcome back to Prospects Channel TV. Thank you for this coming out here. May God bless you all. Amen. The Supreme Court has temporarily stopped the Nigerian government move to stop the use of old Naira note on February 10, 2023. This was stated in a ruling given by a seven-member panel led by Justice John Okoro for an ex parte application brought by three northern states of Kaduna, Kogi, and Zamfara states. The three states had specifically applied for another of interim injunction restraining the federal government through the Central Bank of Nigeria, CBN, or the commercial banks from suspending or determining or ending on February 10, the 2023, the, the time frame which, with which the new administration with an uh, older vision of the 200 Naira, 500 and 1,000 denomination of the Naira may no longer be legal tender pending the hearing and the determination of their motion on notice for inter interlocutory injunction. On Wednesday, Mr. A.I. Mustafa San, counsel for the applicant, urged the Supreme Court to grant the application in the interest of justice and the well-being of Nigeria. It stated that the policy of the government had led to an excruciating situation that is almost leading to anarchy in the land. While referring to Central Bank of Nigeria, CBN, statistics indicating that more than 60% of Nigerians do not have bank accounts, Mustafa lamented that the few Nigerians who do have bank accounts are unable to assess their funds as a result of the policy. Delivering ruling in the motion, Justice Okoro held that after a careful consideration of the motion, ex parte, this application is granted as prayed an order of interim injunction restraining the federal government through the Central Bank of Nigeria, CBM, or the com commercial banks from suspending or determining or ending on February 10, 2023, the time frame with which the the now older vision of the 200, 500, and 1,000 denomination of the Naira may no longer be legal tender pending the hearing and determination of their motion on notice for the interlocutory injunction. He accordingly adjoined to February 15, 2023 for hearing of the main suit. Nigerians have been having difficulty obtaining the new Naira notes as the February 10 deadline approaches. This was why some banks in the states have been attacked and protests in states such as Ondo, Edo, Oyo have devolved into riots. Banks have recently been the target of violent attacks when riots erupted, erupted over the weekend in Ibadan. A Wema Bank branch was vandalized. Many banks have increased their security and caution as a result of this. Due to the heightened tensions across by the country's protracted Naira scarcity, some commercial banks on Tuesday ordered the closure of some of their branches until further notice. Governors of the ruling party had met with the presidential uh, with the president, I beg your pardon, last week and pleaded with him to allow old notes and the new notes to coexist. 
The president had told them to give him seven days to look into the issues arising from Naira redesign. However, after the meeting, Godwin Emefele, the CBN governor, warned that the Appis Bank was not considering shifting the February 10 deadline for the old notes to, to cease being illegal tender. The Supreme Court's injunction means in recent, it is expected as a case, the cases between the governors and the president can only be settled at the at the SC. The sensitive issues is slated to be argued on the seventh, on the fifteenth. That is what this uh, they are talking about. I'm not telling all everybody here, but I have finished. Okay, I can't really get that. Reactions by Nigerians. This Emi Feles black ass should be thrown into a dungeon and the kid thrown into Atlantic Ocean. The man is the devil personified. His hatred for Nigerians because he lost the presidential bid is deep rooted and he enjoys seeing the citizens in distress. I think it, it makes him it makes him a wicked person, okay? God punish, okay, I can't really take that. Okay, guys, these are some reactions by Nigerians. Let's hear from you. What's your view on this?